I had to scroll back so far, Gigi, I couldn't find it. So let's just do another one. Remember, I always take corrective criticism. I'm new, so this is made out of mainly like four different kits. But I'm collecting slowly but surely to do my own and not have it all just kits. Well, I did make my own paper in here. My own tea, tea, tea dyed paper. This is for my brother who is, his birthday's uh, coming up. <laughs> there. I put some washi or something here to cover this up. This is his Book of Shadows journal. Instead of having it so stark white, I inked it. Pocket, not a pocket. This is what the uh, which is called a uh, a witch's ladder as the in the old days they would travel and pick up thistles and thorns and pieces of glass and, uh, so now I'm modern so I make a witch's ladder out of beads <laughs> or in his case things that pertain to witchy stuff you know feathers and well okay don't I, I didn't say that exactly right but you know what I mean so y'all don't write to me about it it won't end well for you Found some cute little witchy papers on Etsy. Thank God. Cute little bugs and whatnot. The rest of that from Etsy. Crystal and cleans, cleansing your tools and things like that. As you can tell, I don't like straight <laughs> lines very well. Uh, I'm getting better at cutting, but I still have a ways to go. Oh. I know I shouldn't have put these here to both together. Uh, lesson learned for next time. Oops. Sorry, didn't mean to pull on you. I wanted to cut these, but I didn't like that idea, so. Yep, that's the paper I made. I'm so proud of myself. And, I mean, because you don't think about <clears throat> making paper unless you're doing this kind of stuff. I don't know what else I'm going to put right there. Let's 
some doodads there. I need to print out more ephemera. You're such a good brother sometimes, Magic. Good boy. Good boy for loving on your sister. Oops. I'm plugged in. I keep accidentally pulling on the cord. I told him he's going to need one of those gold marker kind of pens <laughs> if he wants to write on the pictures. A lot of times, as you can see, I don't like putting writing on top of pictures. I want you to see the picture. <clears throat> So I'm collecting slowly but surely, making my own paper, and I'm going to put another large charm like this dragon over here on top of this, because I goofed, and you can see the glue. Don't want that. I made him a cute little, I guess you could call it a charm. Uh, since I wire weave jewelry, it seems only appropriate, right? I'm going to take a stencil and ink these with trees and birds and stuff. I started doing this because uh, I made thank I made thank you cards for my jewelry customers. And I, then I found out about the uh, the little folio kits that just you know flap over flap over and you glue it into a page in your journal. So I would just put something on the back and make it a a bifold card and say thank you to my customers that are so good to me. And I thought, oh, what is that? And then I found a folio. <laughs> yeah. The lady who makes um, this, she makes nice, thick, fat folios. So occasionally I'll send those to my customers because it's just so relaxing creating them. And even when I fudge up and run out of ink, I'm not throwing nothing away. It cost me too much money to be throwing anything away. Yeah, you fit in here before without folding down. Just fit in there again. Thank you. How do I keep sliding over? Fold out and fold out and fold out. I'm going to ink some lines and put on there later. I didn't know what to do with this 
I didn't want to have a seam there, so I didn't want to put paint.